Hi all, welcome to another video. I had to change my mobile phone recently, hence I had to set up the BMW Dashcam app also in the new mobile. There is a dedicated video on the Dashcam in the channel. Please check it out if you are looking for any information on that. This video is purely on how to set up the BMW Advanced Car i 2.0 application to manage the Dashcam in the mobile phone. Let us get on with it then. The first step as always is to download the application and install it. Since I have the Ace 2.0, I will install the app for that. For those who have the 3.0, can install the 3.0 app. When that is done, let's open it and see how to connect to the dashcam. So you select the brand, which is BMW in my case. Agree to the terms and conditions. You can see that the SSID field is pre-populated with the name. That name is supposed to match the name of the Wi-Fi network of your car. Otherwise, the app won't be able to make a connection with the dashcam. Only when the two devices enter into the same Wi-Fi network will they be able to connect. Let me show you. So the password, if you have not changed, is going to be the default. So when I click the connect, the app will notify me that it wants to connect to the Wi-Fi network named BMW Ace 2.0, which was the pre-populated name in the SSID field. But like I said, my car's Wi-Fi network name is different and there is no Wi-Fi network named BMW Ace 2.0 which is available to join. Hence it throws an error that it cannot join a network in that name. So the next step would be to go and find the car's Wi-Fi network. So I go to the settings, Wi-Fi, here I can see my car's Wi-Fi network. I select that network to connect to and there you go, I have selected the network. Now, we will go back to the app and try to connect again. This time, I'm going to change the prefill name and give the car's Wi-Fi network name. Give the password and then connect. It will ask me whether to allow the app to join my car's network. This time, a network with that name exists and it should be able to connect. I will join. And now it did not throw the error and takes me to the next step where I'm supposed to uh, give the name of the device. I'll give a name and click done. There you go. You can see that the app shows that it is connected to the dash cam. To confirm this, we can go to the live feed and check the cameras. Yes, we have the feed, so we are good. Now you can go to the settings and uh, set your preferences related to the driving and parking modes, camera, etc. The recording section will show you all the recorded footage. Uh, yes, it is not that complicated to the record setup in your mobile to connect to the dash cam. The one thing which I think I missed to mention in the video on the dash cam is that the app also allows us to download a high definition version of the video. So that's all about connecting to the dash cam using the BMW Ace app. Until we meet again uh, with a different video, thanks for watching and bye bye everyone.